Laguna Beach, California. Well, as we told you at the top of the show, Democratic presidential candidate Eric Swalwell committed an almost unprecedented act of honesty recently when he talked about guns. He didn't talk about background checks or barrel shrouds. He was far more blunt. He said, we're banning semi-automatic rifles, if I'm president. We're going to take them from their owners by force, and anyone who refuses to comply goes to jail. That's the Swalwell program. Quentin James is co-founder of the Collective PAC, pretty familiar with democratic politics, and Mr. James joins us tonight. Um, thanks so much for coming on. So uh, we've had Swalwell on this show a bunch of different times about Russia. We've never had him on about guns. He won't come on. So I, I'm interested in your take on this. I don't think I'm misunderstanding it. In fact, I'm not. What he's saying is that anybody who possesses a legal product today will soon be a felon when he makes that product illegal, and without committing any act of violence, that person can be imprisoned. That sounds like mass incarceration to me. I would think you'd be against it. Well, Tucker, thanks for having me. Uh, obviously, again, oh, you, you do have it a little wrong. Um, Congressman Swalwell did say uh, he wants to ban, uh, you know, military-style assault rifles. He also said that folks who want to keep them would be able to do so at a gun club or a hunter's range um, in a locker. Uh, so it's not taking them by force. It would be a buyback program. Again, this is his proposal, um, not, not mine. No, 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 but uh, he so just said, I'm sorry. No, it's, I know it's not your proposal, but he just said, he said twice, he actually wrote a USA Today op-ed saying it, and then he just said it mm -hmm. on CNN. People who don't give up their guns will go to jail. He just said that. So it's not a buyback right. program. People, That's a gun you know, confiscation by who, force. Who don't and if you the don't law, agree, we're going to imprison you. People who don't you. follow the law will, will be prosecuted. Now, what the charges okay. are... Okay, and the what law the, is you how, can't how, have how, the guns in your home. Well, correct. he just, he's really, he couldn't be clearer. So, like, look, we, we, we can't debate what he's saying. He was, you're mischaracterizing it. I just played the, the, the clip. Let's debate the, the proposal itself. Correct, but, but you would get but a civil war if you did this. Why would you want to do this? That you are not talking about that are really important. And, and listen, I think look, the majority of Americans agree that we need to fix our broken uh, gun law um, um, system. We we have a, a, a broken system here where folks are okay, that, that, but that's uh, you know just, that's banal. Loophole, we're, we're talking about a specific. Buy, okay, no, I got but, it. Okay, but but, but, right, but, it's, okay. but it's about no, no. But I just gave you. This is so frustrating. I, I, so here's a presidential this candidate. Is about the issue. Here, it's really simple. Yes. It is the issue. Here's a Democratic presidential candidate who is offering Correct. a very specific solution, which you are ignoring because it's embarrassing. No, I'm not. Why don't you just no, no, say, no, yes, I support putting people in prison if they don't give up their guns, or no, I don't no, support it. But Tucker, why are you saying I su I support this stuff that's irrelevant to the specific? I, I support Would you support putting people band. in prison? If they don't, don't give up if, their guns. If people, if people want to break the law, whatever the punishment for those crimes are, they should, yeah, they should definitely deal with. I do agree with that, yes. Man, man, you guys are, you guys are reckless. People wouldn't give up. I would but never Tucker, give up We've already gun. had Under an assault weapons ban in this country for 10 years. No, no, no. We've already done it. If I yes, have a have firearm in my house and I'm posing no threat, I'm not giving it up. And most Americans it's wouldn't. Not about and any so, and weapon. You know it's that. not about any weapons. So what are keep we your gonna... pistols, keep your shotguns. This is about military-style weapons and getting them off of our streets. Right. This is a big problem man. in terms of You're scaring people and talk like this. You're scaring me. Look, we all want to be able to defend ourselves. We all, I agree with the the second because Amendment. you want total power, and Amendment. you know that. So this is, no, no it's not about total don't. power, Tucker. This is about saving yes, it's children's about total lives. Power, and we're hip For to all this. of your viewers, okay. all of your all viewers right. who being are told church going, going, out of time. faithful people, it, I would hate yeah. for them to be able, um, or I, I, what I, I would want hate for them, for them to be able to go to, to, church, go to go prison to for safe. exercising their constitutional rights. Not worry about some crazed or anything coming in. Please don't try this crap on America. All right, all right, we're out of time. Mr. James, thank you very much. I appreciate it.